All right, what's up, YouTube? We are back here with Daryl, and we have a special guest, Cody Crowley. Co Cody's actually an MMA fighter. Boxer. Boxer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, professional boxer. Um, currently 13 and 0, seven knockouts. My next fight is coming up May 5th at the Peterborough Memorial Center for uh, the CPBC Super Welterweight Canadian Title. So I'm pretty excited about that. But I'm also excited about this, what we're doing today. Um, <clears throat> you know, I'm pretty new into the crypto scene. Um, I I came across Daryl actually um, on social media through Facebook, all because I didn't have the right resources, um, the right education. All I've been hearing about is crypto, crypto, all this weird blockchain stuff, and I would try to look into it, and I would just get totally lost. Um, and one day I came across Daryl, and you know he was actually looking for um, help getting the word out, you know, about the the Coincierge Club. And I was like, shoot, this guy's in Vegas. I've spent months trying to track down people in Vegas. You know, I'm not from here, I'm from Canada. So the fact that he's right here, I could drive to his house and he could sit down and explain things to me, let's do it. Um, and the second that we actually got in contact, um, I started telling him about my boxing career. He started telling me more about his company and right, right away, you know, um, it wasn't a sales pitch that he was telling me. I get a lot of people trying to, you know, give me sales pitches and different investments. He just told me about his company, and I was totally blown away. Um, if he was giving a sales pitch, he hit a home run. Um, <laughs> this technology—that's why I'm trying to get educated on because mm -hmm. um, it's it's just so amazing. Um, it seems complicated, but it's super simple. Um, you know, actually, me and Daryl just set up my. Uh, Coincierge Club wallet within, I would say, three to five minutes. Um, Very straightforward. And, yeah, and I'm not techie at all. And it, it was a, it was a super easy walkthrough. Now, Daryl, can you explain, like, what's the difference between the Coincierge Club wallet and a lot of other wallets out there? Um, you know, elaborate on, like, the different coins you can hold, the yep. transaction times, different things like that. So, most people are familiar with uh, some of the more major wallets that are out there, but... Um, Coinbase is really an exchange, and that's usually what most people use. And they hold what's called your private key, which means they hold your money. They're in control of it. A lot of the exchanges that are out there also hold your private key. What differentiates us from them is we allow you to hold your private key information. We allow you the sole responsibility of backing up your seed phrase. And that gives you the responsibility of your money and not someone on a corporate side where if there was a denial of service attack, the money would just disappear. The only way for you to jeopardize your own money is if you let somebody have your private keys. That's one of the biggest points uh, as far as a mobile wallet is concerned. Then when you get into the compatibility, we offer over 20, what, 1,200, no, sorry, 12,000 different coins that are out there on the platform. The next closest uh, wallet that's out there is 125 coins. So there's a huge, huge space that we just own right now. Um, we're working with Komodo to make it even more. We're working with Komodo to do atomic swaps, to bring in some of the ERC-20 coins that are out there, some of the more unique chains that uh, actually don't operate on, say, a, a Bitcoin protocol or a Ethereum protocol, but have created their own uh, blockchains. We're working to incorporate pretty much every cryptocurrency out there so that there is one centralized location for all your decentralized assets. One of the other major unique selling propositions of this product is its speed. It's 250,000 transactions per second. It's unheard of speed. It's three times faster than what Visa can do currently. And to give you an example, the cryptocurrency that everybody knows about, Bitcoin, can only do seven transactions per second. Ethereum, the next most popular cryptocurrency out there, 15 to 17 transactions per second. How much did you say yours was? 250,000 transactions per second. So to say that, that we, we're unique and that we're trying to corner the market is an understatement. I really appreciate Cody for you know getting on board with us. I mean, every single time I talk to somebody, they can see the passion, they can understand the project, and it's just about getting the word out. Now to have someone that's as known as Cody that's involved with this project and also able to use it. And I think that's one of the coolest parts is that you don't need to have a PhD, which I don't, I don't, wanna, I don't have a PhD, but you don't need to have a PhD. You don't have to be a computer programmer. You don't have to have a certain technical level of skill set. Everybody can access it. Everybody can figure it out and everybody can set it up in three to five minutes. And then you know what happens? Everybody's in control of their own money. And that's the one thing that most people say when they talk about Bitcoin that you can't do, that you can't spend it. 
we've created the solution to allow you to spend your cryptocurrency on normal goods and services that you need every day. We've got eight vendors in the Las Vegas area alone. We're expanding as fast as we possibly can. And believe me, I'm, with this I'm, international reach. I'm excited to go to the clubs yeah. and uh, actually be able to make a transaction mm -hmm. without spending Absolutely. US dollars. Absolutely. So that's where we're at. That's, that's what we're doing. And I mean, every time we do one of these videos, more people find out about us. Every time we do one of these videos, we release more information. We have a business license. This is our business license right here. We have an FDIC insured bank account. It's unheard of in the cryptocurrency space. We have, are in compliance with the SEC. People are scared of the SEC and we have all of our regulation disclosures lined out. We have our exemption lined out. When we get to the certain level we need to, we're gonna file our S1. This company is going public and that in itself is a milestone for the cryptocurrency space. Again, this aren't, I'm not selling you guys, these are facts. This is what we do. Um, if you choose to use the application, great. If you don't, I'm sure you're you know, gonna find something else that works for you and is compatible with your needs, but this is the future. This is the fastest way to move currency. It's the most secure way to move currency. We're a US-based company. Our software is in the United States. Our business is licensed in the United States. There's really not much more that you can say about a company compared to some of the companies that are out there where People are trusting their money to these exchanges, and when you look where they're actually registered, it's in non-extraditable countries. And they're in other places that are very, very hard to track somebody down if the money happens to go missing. So again, these are just the reasons why, you know, Cody finds out about us, he loves the idea that we're in Nevada. Yeah, be before um, we, me and you met, you know, I was, I pretty much jumped on like 10 or 15 different coins that I came across mm -hmm. that people are basically just pumping up, and I was, hesitant and scared of a scam mm -hmm. right and afraid that my money would just uh, basically i'd be throwing it out the window but what's different about the coin sierra's club um so what's really different about coin sierra's club is we built this organically we didn't go out and have a million dollar marketing budget we didn't pay to get it listed on exchanges we didn't go out and use the pump and dump tactics and use the fomo tactics and use all this uh, the tactics that are kind of seen as you know shady and, and could potentially be considered securities violations We built a strong business model We built a strong product and we let the product stand for itself and our growth has been a little bit slower than we had expected But the growth is stronger and that's the most important thing. I mean for for example Verge I'm gonna use verge because a lot of people know about it. It's one of the more popular cryptocurrencies, but it's a major major I don't want to say complete scam, I just want to say that it's got its own issues, meaning the team puts out a roadmap, they don't hit their roadmap. A team puts out expectations of what their coin can do, it can't actually do those things. And when you look at what we're saying, we've got our coin, it's proven, it's tradable, it's got value, it has an actual product connected to it, because I don't think we actually talked about the fact that the Coin Sierra's Club Coins has a physical person connected to it that'll book you hotels, that'll book you nightclubs, that'll set you up with information, reservations, and potentially could also be boots on the ground for any potential vacations that are needed. And when you look at you know coins like IOTA that claim to be the Internet of Things and uh, they're gonna you know, make smart pens and smart, you need a supercomputer with 32 gigabytes of processing power to run the IOTA code. You don't need that with us, we've proven uh, that we can operate mobily. We've proven that we can operate on, you know, just just now we were setting up wallets on Windows, wallets on Macintosh, while I was demonstrating wallets on Chrome. The the unique thing about uh, the Coin Sierra's Club that really really you know grabbed my attention was that when, when I first wanted to buy crypto, you know, all right, I'm gonna go buy some Bitcoin, or I'm gonna you know buy some Ethereum, but what am I actually gonna do with it? other than hold it and then try to mm -hmm. hopefully make some money, mm -hmm. right? And sell it when the price goes up. But what attracted me about you is that I can actually use this coin in everyday life mm -hmm. for real goods and services on the strip right here in Las Vegas. Yep. Um, and the fact that, you know, if I went and buy some Bitcoin, I can't really pick up the phone and get help. Mm -hmm. You know, if, if I run into an issue where I can literally pick up my phone and call Daryl yep. and or, or um, you know, someone else on the team that will actually go and tell me where I can go and use my coin, where I can go 
and book a hotel um, or where if I wanted to go sell my coin when the price goes up, you know, and actually make back U.S. currency. Um, it, it's, it's pretty incredible. Yeah, we believe in transparency. And easy, and, easy. You know, well, thank you. I appreciate that, man. Uh, we want to make sure that all our information is out there. We want to make sure that it's easy for you to get a hold of us. And believe it, believe me when I say this, if you want to go over to that TV screen over there, I'll show you something. You can get direct contact with us from our site right here. That number right there, that's my cell phone number. That address right there, that's where we're at right now. That's a business located in Nevada. That's an actual phone number that you can call and get an actual person pretty much 24 hours a day. When call volume gets to the level that we anticipate it, we have a deal in place with the largest telecommunications company in the world, Telus Communications, to handle all of our call volume 24 seven. They have 24 agents on standby with a training program for us. So we're prepared to grow, but we're also prepared to take care of our customers every single step of the way and offer what I like to call the Vegas treatment, a five star, five diamond service. And that's what we offer. And that's because we're nightclub guys and we're casino guys. And that's where we got our start and that's where we learned service. That's where we learned hospitality. And that's where we learned that the only thing you've got is transparency and your integrity. And so when we built this, we wanted to make sure that it could stand on its own. Uh, you know, another unique thing about you, Daryl, is that people hear all the time about all these other cryptocurrencies and they get all these pitches, but they don't, they won't jump on it mm -hmm. or pull the trigger. Mm -hmm. um, it seems like anytime you put the Coin Sierra Club in front of someone's actual eyes, you pull the trigger. Mm -hmm. um, well, not you pull the trigger, the people they pull do. the trigger. Um, so it seems to me that you basically just need to get in front of more people and spread the word and it's it's gonna take over. Absolutely, and you know, well, again, we appreciate you helping us out. This is the type of, uh, type of uh, campaign that we want to run where you know it's somebody that believes in the product that has the product Cody's a coin holder Cody's <laughs> yes, a coin I holder am. we sponsored his fight with tokens this is the first ever a boxing fight sponsored by cryptocurrency I'm, I'm pretty excited about that so we're uh, you know you guys have any questions reach out uh, my number is 949-610-2270 uh, you can reach me at Daryl it's D-A-R-R-Y-L-L -L, at CryptoCashHub.com you can also reach at coincierge at cryptocashhub.com uh, and all our social channels. So please uh, reach out if you guys have any questions. And just thank, thank you, Cody, for being involved in this, man. Uh, thank you, man. Um, it's going to be you know one hell of a ride, I think. I think I'm so. I'm excited to see your growth. I think so. So let's say I'm a business owner and I want to download this app and I want to start accepting cryptocurrency. Can you give me like a quick demonstration of how it works? Yeah, so if you're a business owner, it's actually straightforward. What you would do, so... We would actually obviously have to get in contact with each other, so we would have a face-to-face -face meeting and you've decided that you wanna go forward and accept cryptocurrency. All you do is pull out your phone, or I pull out my phone, you create an account, takes three minutes. Within two hours, I'll have a vendor portal built out for you. And what that is, I'll, here, I'll pull it up on there. That's our dev environment. As you can see, it's Daryl's Pub. But this right here actually makes QR codes on the fly. So let's say we're gonna sell a beer. Uh, we're gonna make it an IPA. And so we create that. Then the user comes over and scans their code on their app. I'm just gonna pull that up real quick. And so what the user would do is they would come over and scan that QR code with their application and it would pull that information up and actually take the coins out of their wallet and then drop it down into Daryl's Pub account. So a business owner could come in here and create a unique QR code for all their products and services, have Correct. it all posted up in the store, and the people can just come in there and really easy pull out their phone and boom, pay for it right there on the store. Absolutely. Now, this right here is in beta. Um, we're actually could be developing this to be a standalone application as well. And when that standalone application comes out, you'll be able to split tabs. You'll be able to have multiple line items on the tabs. You'll be able to clock in your workers. You'll be able to track inventory. All the basic features that you would have with a point of sale. Um, and those are milestones that we're gonna be reaching down the road as we develop this out. But the rudimentary form is there to be able to transfer the coins. Um, and so the venues that, are, that have this have this interface set up for them. You're really bringing crypto to life well, in the everyday, this is an a, everyday situation. This is gonna change the game right here. I wanna show you guys one of our clients. 
Take a look at that. You can buy custom tailored suits with cryptocurrency. Custom tailored suits. This is the, they're the number one uh, fashion, men's fashion, tailored fashion shop, uh, multiple shops in Las Vegas. They have uh, one at Planet Hollywood. They have one at the uh, Venetian uh, in the canal shops. Um, they have one that is uh, in Boca Park, and then they have their uh, another location that is on Decatur. And that's a game changer. I wanna show you one more. Anybody that's been following me knows that Goat Sports Bar is on a whole nother level. These guys have created a product that is unique to Las Vegas. In a town that has gaming bar after gaming bar after gaming bar, they've figured out a way to be unique. Now I'm not talking about accepting cryptocurrency. They found out a way to be unique regardless. Then, incorporating cryptocurrency, they are the first sports bar in Nevada to accept Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, Monero, Dash, Waves, Coin Sierra's Club coins. You get the idea. Any coin that's listed on the application, you can buy beers. They have uh, some of the best food that I've had at a sports bar. Buy it with cryptocurrency. Pretty awesome. I think so. I, uh, we're really happy about this. Uh, we're really happy about the direction. Uh, obviously, you know, getting some uh, heavy hitters like you uh, involved in this, and uh, Sean, obviously, for doing the uh, the videos for us, man. We really appreciate you doing all that. Um, nice, nice. Uh, the team's growing. The team's growing, guys. And uh, if you want to get involved, let us know. There's definitely room. Uh, a lot of different opportunities here. Um, but again, everything that we do, SEC compliant. Everything that we do, legal. FDIC insured bank accounts. And could, could you explain the opportunity, like, uh, for other represent representatives that might want to get involved about? <laughs> like residual income and stuff yeah, like that? Yeah, so um, there's, again, with our SEC uh, compliance, there's very uh, strict ways that you have to do certain things. What we can do is say that if you would like to bring vendors on board, then we could potentially, we could set up a, a residual income uh, basis for them. And what it would be, would it would be a piece of every transaction for the lifetime of that account. So it would generate income for you every time someone used that service. So it's kind of like, you would say it's uh, similar to you know being like a rep for a merchant services Correct. or credit card company, except now we're dealing in cryptocurrency. The dealing in cryptocurrency, money. and you're not centric to one or fifteen or twenty-five or one hundred and twenty-five. You've got over twelve thousand different coins that are out there. Awesome. Just to give you guys an idea. I could show you. First of all, if you want to look at that screen right there, as far as our coin is concerned, that's the backend dev information, and you can see right now that there's currently 289 active wallets holding that coin. You can also come over here and see that we can support 12,462 different cryptocurrencies to date. So I appreciate you guys. Um, Cody, now, thank you so much. Again and uh, walking me through this. I thought we would have been sitting here for like an hour. Yeah, um, a couple minutes. Yeah. <laughs>